guys. So we have a package from Plantarino, which I did not place. So I'm assuming that this is the package that Reb and Sue got me for my birthday, which, which was a couple days ago, which, thank you, was not expecting, nor did I ask for it, but thanks. And this is a big box. So we will see what happens. And since I'm not on YouTube, I figured I would come here and unbox it for you guys because everyone can want to see it. Plus it's content I haven't posted in a while. So let's unbox. This is my first time doing an unboxing. And uh, unlike Reb, I have my unboxing knife, which I guess she has one now too, but mine is like a little plant leaf that I carry everywhere because I'm iconic. <laughs> oh, there was a piece of dirt. So it said in here, in our hive, like beehive, love bees. They're super cute. Okay. So we're just going to put that over there. There's multiple things in here. Why is there multiple things in here? So, red. No. Okay. We're going to go with this one is cute. delivered to me like upside down inside out all about I don't know so they come with a tag which I've never ordered from Plantarina which that's nice for people to know like how to take care of the plant if they're new to it I'm not new to plants I believe. Is that what I said? Yeah, a Zen Z. And I have a big CZ, but I do not have a Zen Z. And I also have a Raven. Also, I'm sorry that my voice sounds groggy. I haven't talked to anyone in like days. So it's not the Rona, I promise. Oh, it has a little baby. Can you see that? Look at it. Oh, I love it. Rab. So thank you. Oh my god, it's so thick and cute. I love it. So there was a little soil fallout. That's to be expected. Especially when you're sending plants in soil. How many stalks are in here? This stock looks this stock is brand new, so it must have just been forming before they shipped it. And I have no clue when they ordered it, so I don't know how long it was in shipping, but like they look fine. Oh my gosh. You guys. How many stocks are in here? Four, five, six, seven, eight. And then that little baby stock. Oh, this is a stock too. Nine. Nine stocks and the baby stock. Pretty good. Pretty good. Where are we going to put him? Ooh. Reuse these stocks. I was gonna make um, tiny bamboo poles for some plants, like 
my build engine would probably like a pull. We'll see what happens, but we keep these stakes just because they're nice bamboo stakes. Look at that. Am I, am I an Instagram or a YouTuber now <laughs> with the hand? <laughs> oh, I love it. It's so comp so compact and cute. Let's. Am I able to get my big CC for you guys? Let's see if I can get my big CC out. He's in the closet right now. Mm -hmm. So this is my big ZZ. He is in um, a gallon pot. And he, he is currently living in the closet right now because um, if you see that tool over there, I'm putting tile in finally into the green room. But like, here's a comparison just to one branch of how big it is. A head test maybe, I don't know. I don't know how to do these things. Can you see the... And yes, I'm in pajamas, don't hate it. This is a gallon pot. So this is my big ZZ that I actually got for free. I actually got two of them for free and combined them, but he's looking a little rough. So we're just living our best lives with it. But like, do you see how big of a difference? Maybe you can't. I can. Let's scoot you over here. Okay. What else is in here? Ooh. 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 Okay, so this one had a big wad of this fluff that support. But it was also just like sitting on top, so it res wasn't really doing anything. Another thing we pulled. This one came off really nearly in the box. Okay, this one secured very well. Right. Uh, so come on. They got me this big. Oh, we lost a leaf. That's okay. It was through shipping. Let's get a little bit of soil in the box. A little bit. To be expected. They both had given me cuttings of their princesses because I have a queen. Can you see my... Mm. Here's my queen. Let's bring her down. Ugh. She actually has a half moon leaf. So this is my queen. I got her for $8. I don't know. I got her locally, which was very surprising to me that she was so cheap and I love her. And I shared pieces of my Crimson Queen with them because they didn't have queen, which I was like, okay, I'll give you a little bit. So I gave them, I think, four nodes each. I don't remember. I think four nodes. And then they gave me some branches of their princess, which I suppose I could pull out. Mm, that's a lot of work. I have them, mm, you won't be able to see, but they're right up here. I have like a humidity chamber with uh, African violet propagations and that kind of stuff. So. They're in their rooting. And then they sent me this huge, 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 huge princess. Which there, oh, we have another casualty. That's okay. Oh, that was a pretty leaf too. Look at it. It was like splashy. Mm. Did this one have a tag? Yes, yes it did. Yeah. This one also had a tag. 
which is nice. That's good. Tags are good. But we'll get it. Mm, I love it. A little bit crunchy. A little bit soft from shipping, which if you guys don't know, it's better to ship plants dry than wet. Is that a peduncle? I don't think it's a peduncle. Maybe it is. I don't know. I've never had a Hoya flower. This was just a damaged leaf, so we pulled that off. This one's damaged too. But that's what happens when you ship plants. They get a little banged up. God, how many pieces are in here? It is so pink. Oh, it's so cute. Overall, I think the growth points are good. How many stalks are in here? Because this is a lot more stalks than my $8 Crimson Queen had. I think my Queen had five stalks. This definitely has more. Oh, and they're pretty long. This one's all tangled up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, maybe, maybe ten. Look at it. Mm, I love it. It just. I'm gonna have to make a macrame for this because it has too many beautiful trailing vines to just hang out on my shelf. Oh, maybe, maybe you could hang out on my shelves. Maybe not. We'll find out. But it, where is the thing that I thought was a bit of cool? It has like an aerial root. Can you guys see that? I don't know if you can see that. Probably not. It was out of focus the whole time. But it has like these little aerial roots. Like, there's another one down here. Which, I don't know what that means, but that's... That's exciting. Here's another one. I've never had a Hoya have big aerial roots. Like, mine all have, like, these little nubbies. But they don't have, like, full roots. Like, that's a full root. Almost, well, full root. <sighs> so cute. This is a uh, princess, right? Some of the leaves are like splashy, but some of the leaves are like princessy. So I don't know if that's a tri color. Let me look at this like invoicey. Hoya Exotica is what it says. I don't know what that means. It's super pretty though. Like even this, like it has like strawberry type vibes. Look at this leaf. This leaf is like weird. I don't know. It's super healthy though. So I'm gonna have to go figure out what a Hoya Exotica is because I thought this was a princess. Maybe it's just their version of the princess. I don't know. It's super, super pretty though. So, this is our haul, uh, well, birthday present from Rub and Sue. I love it. Thank you. I can't wait to see you guys again, which is hopefully soon. And now I have a mess to clean up, which is okay. So, if you guys know what a Hoya exotica is let me know but it's super pretty i don't have to find a space for this little zenzi 
Hmm. Probably up here by my Raven. But in case you guys were wondering what my tiniest CZ was, which I know you're not, but this is my tiniest CZ. I it was it has its own bulb and everything. And I actually pulled it from my big CZ because it was just like hanging out. I was like, you don't belong in there. You're way too tiny. And it actually does have a growth point, so it's gonna have another branch soon. But look at that. It's the tiniest little ZZ ever. It's like a seedling. <sighs> okay. Now that I have all the ZZ flavors, except for variegated, and the one that turns normal after it's green, or yellow after it's variegated, and the Japanese one, I will have to get those, I guess, because I have every other kind, which is exciting. Thank you guys. I am gonna link Reb down in the, in the description box, per se. And Sue doesn't have a public account, so you guys can just sound off for her down below thanking her if you want to, because honestly, they didn't have to give me anything to go to stash. But thank you guys. I love you.